Yes, this is Black Friday. Tomorrow is what's called Small Business Saturday. It's a day in which shoppers are encouraged to shop local. Now, with that in mind, there's a new store downtown you might want to stop by. News Channel 15's Brett Thomas takes us to Fancy and Staple and introduces us to an owner who was willing to take a risk. Near the corner of Jefferson and Broadway, in the shadow of a sign of decay, is a downtown up-and-comer, a little business that could, filled with art and mugs and candles and dreams. It's very unique, um, maybe a little edgy, very like big city. It belongs to Tabor Olinger. The idea was hers too. It found footing in February. Less than a year. And then in October, took flight. It's been great, every single part of it. Even, right. even the little hiccups along the way didn't even phase me. Each part was amazing. She could have done a strip mall somewhere out in the Fort Wayne about, but instead she went urban, took a chance on downtown, a fancy and staple shopkeep pioneer. I would like to be considered something like that. Hopefully people look at it that way. They do. This will bring other people to like do stuff like this. It'll start other people's minds like, you know, Maybe I can do a store downtown, you know, and... Yeah, kind of help put Fort Wayne on the map a bit. Yeah. Olinger is exactly what the city says it's looking for. A young entrepreneur with a keen mind, ready to set up shop in the city center of the Summit City. I feel like I'm doing this for the people of Fort Wayne, so they have something, you know, cool to come to. Instead of going to Indy or Chicago, they can just come downtown. And while they're down here, they can hit up the city shops and all the other new businesses that are starting. The beginning of a new beginning. I want to do this forever. On the corner of where old meets new, Brett Thomas, News Channel 15.